I'm Sophie Marquez. I'm a lecturer at Stellenbosch University in South Africa. Last year, I planted the seed of the wizard coup. It grew into a tree thanks to an amazing team. Now we want to make it a forest. The 9th November 1989, I was a few days away from my third birthday. It was in a small village in the Pyrenees Montaigne with my parents and my three sisters in France. My youngest sister, she is also my best friend, she joined this project. She is a neuroscientist in Harvard and this project gave us the opportunity to share our expertise. She is proud of the project. As a child, I always wanted to become a teacher. My parents, taken out of school very early, taught me that education could change our life for the best. I wanted to share this opportunity with everyone. I started to teach at the age of 15 and I never stopped. So many walls have been built around math, creating anxiety and discomfort. These walls disconnect the subject from reality, other disciplines and gives the impression that it lacks humanity. I realized that it was difficult for students to make use of what I was teaching in everyday life. Too many bricks between schools and universities and as we advance life. This project aims to break those walls and give everyone the opportunity to learn math, a very important and vital life skill. Math can equip us all and give everyone a fair chance. With this project, we aim to break the stigma around mathematics. Wisaka aims to make mathematics more human and strives to encourage people to use mathematics to attain their goals. As a lecturer, one of the things I have found sad is that many students after graduating do not engage with mathematics any further. The project aims to change this. The origin of the project was the uselessness and the sadness I was feeling going teaching. The team will tell you more about that. We are surprised by how many people tell us that they can relate to this project. The discussions and the magazine have certainly influenced all of us involved. The project is also continuously evolving as our community evolves. Our contributors are from different disciplines and backgrounds and contribute in many forms that are all equally valued. Wazaku is a place where you can think about math without walls and connect math to everything and everyone. A complicated problem, but with many of us collaborating at all different levels of perception and expertise, may be the start to an answer. So combining our strengths with a psychological lens, making mathematics more human, and refragmenting knowledge, leading to more informed, open minds capable of making conscious decisions more adapted to our uniqueness and authenticity. Our relationship with mathematics has a big impact on how we see ourselves and society. As a teacher, I've seen how my students have really battled through the mathematics and once they've persevered, how they have really thrived. They've learned life skills such as focusing and empathy, critical thinking, as well as mindfulness. A society that is empowered with these skills and with these perspectives they will learn to make sustainable decisions for themselves as well as the planet. Where would we be if by chance we change our mellow model of math into a warm, welcoming art? What might we achieve if anxiety received the words, never again dare I touch you, that we utter after every problem? Why could we grow if only emotion prevailed in the soulless confines of a scratch glass disc? When will we learn if life is full of maths, we are to be obligated to teach and love both alike?
there are many questions that remain unanswered, such as how do we expand our reach into disadvantaged communities and make a tangible difference in their lives? We will solve this issue with our social impact branch of ASAPU. The goal is to ensure that our social impact projects will be multifaceted and work toward empowering disadvantaged communities surrounding us through education, as well as to provide a simple basic need to this community. It always makes me sleepless to wonder how can one guide someone to be their best without breaking their authentic self.